myself of Mr. Gunath Narayan Jamri, Department of Chemistry, from the way of Avro Patil Mahajali, Pandarpur. Today we have to perform our new experiment about physical chemistry. I want that those experiment is a fourth experiment. And those are completely depends upon instrument. Name of the instrument of this experiment is potential meter here. Those experiments which are performed in three ways. First one, that is calibration of given instrument. Then second part is actually titration about potential dichromate and other ammonium sulfate solution to determine here that is redox, redox potential of AP plus plus oblique AP plus 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 system here. I say to you here about this part, um, maybe like here about the third part that is a nature of graph calculation and result here. This is the three parts of this particular experiment here. First of all, we have to warm up this instrument by switch on of that instrument. And we have to wait a few minutes to warm up this instrument here. Then we have to second, secondly, caliber of this instrument. The standard value at 25 degree Celsius of the temperature the EMF of this instrument is 1.0185 volts. But about this instrument, there are only four digits. Then we have to read those reading is 1.018 volts. Then we have to adjust this knob to say in the downward directions. That's right here, these situations. And the reading will be obtain a 1.018 volts. At these situations, we have to just stop this knob and those instrument is a performer or useful to carry out the further experiments in details. Say about this requirement I should give you. This is a one half set. This is a second half set. In first half set, we have to fill the caramel electrode with saturated solutions of potassium chloride. Then second half cell which contain here, we have to withdraw 10 ml of aerous ammonium sulfate solution to given in this stock solutions here. Then we have to add here two normal of sulfuric acid that is one test tube we have to supply this two normal sulfuric acids. Then we have to dilute the given solution up to 50 ml, means we have to add a distilled water in this uh, solution or weaker here, that is a 50 ml. Then we have to just stir by means of this conditions here. This is a second half cell. Okay? In first half cell, that is a calorie electrode. Those are connected to the device means potentiometer, that is a negative terminal say black. Then we have to insert the platinum electrode in a second half cell and connect it to the device that is a potentiometer that is a rate. Isn't it? Then those experiments are fully we have to observe by means of without addition of the potassium dichromate solution that is the first reading here. Say so about the reading that is a 0 0.346. This is our first reading. Isn't it? Then, after observing first reading on the potentiometers, we have to fill the rate by means of here potassium dichromate solution. Just we have to give one a potassium dichromate solution and we have to fill those solutions in that burette and we have to remove the air bubble and add. 1 ml of potassium dichromate solution in second half cell which contain here that is a FS10 ml then 1 test tube of sulfuric acid and 2 
only solution is a dynamic tape. Then we have to just add a potassium dichromate solution that is 1 mm. Okay? Then we have to just stir. Okay? Wait, wait a few seconds and then you have to observe the radiator. That is the second radiator. Isn't it? Then again we have to add one mm. Then again we have to observe, see, just here, then we have to read the third reading here. Then again add here 1 ml. in the paper and we have to observe the reading. The reading just like here increasing all the way. Isn't it? Okay. At the time being, after completion of 4 ml of potassium dichromate solution in beaker, then we have to add here a 0.2 ml every time up to here 6 ml. Means 4.2, 4.4, 4.6, 4.8, 5 5.0, 5.2, 5.4, 5.6, 5.8 and 6.0 Every time And we have to read those in here Say about here 4.2 We have to just observe Ready? That's the thing Then again 4.4 Then 4.6 Then 4.8 5.0 up to here 6 ml and lastly we have to add up to here 10 ml of this potassium dichromate solution in that beaker and we have to observe every time those readings. Okay here? Yeah? After the 10 ml we have to observe all the readings are occur in a, on the potassium meters and those are our observation tables. Just remember about here this uh, total readings and we have to perform a tabular forms of the result in this observation table in the manner here first of all here observation table serial number then secondly ml of potassium dichromate added then third year EMN observed in holes then after observations we have to go further here that is a delta E in holes, then we will also uh, obtain one of the next column that is a delta V in CM cube and lastly we have to take here the ratio of delta E and second delta phi that is a volt per CM cube here that is our particular observation table every addition of this dichromate solution we have to give one 1 to 4, then 4 to 6, that is point addition, then 6 to 10 here, 1 ml addition. We have to totally observe and we have to tabular, we have to prepare a tabular form of our observation table. After those, we have to require a third part. I want that tomorrow we have to discuss about a third part of this instrument, potentiometry, that is a nature of graph calculation and that results. I want that here to stop. Tomorrow we have to discuss the remaining part. Okay? Okay.